ഓക്കെ നമുക്ക് ന്യൂക്ലിയർ പ്രോപ്പർട്ടീസ് ന്യൂക്ലിയർ പോസ് നോക്കാം ഓൾറെഡി പഠിച്ചിട്ടുണ്ട് ഒന്നും കൂടി റിവൈസ് ചെയ്ത് നോക്കാം നമുക്ക് ഓക്കെ ഇത് വൺ ഇമ്പോർട്ടൻറ്റ് പ്രോപ്പർട്ടീസ് ദ ഇൻട്രാക്ഷൻ ബിറ്റ്വീൻ ടു ന്യൂക്ലിയോൺസ് കൺസിസ്റ്റ് ലോവസ്റ്റ് ഓർഡർ ഓഫ് എൻ അട്രാക്റ്റീവ് സെൻട്രൽ പൊട്ടൻഷ്യൽ the common characteristics of these potentials is that they depend only on the internuclear distance r we therefore represent the central term as v c of r the experimental program to study v c of r would be to measure the energy dependence of nuclear nucleon parameters such as scattering phase shift and then to try to choose the form of Um, for we see how far that the best reproduces those parameters actually kid varnu kanale the nuclear force is an attractive attractive central potent central force then second property is the nucleon nucleon interaction is strongly spin dependent nam nertha kandadana the nuclear force must satisfy certain symmetries which restricts the possible forms that the potential could have examples of these symmetries are parity r to minus r and time reversal time to minus t experiments indicate that we a high degree of precision one part in 10 power 7 for parity and one part in 10 power 3 for time reversal the internuclear potential is invariant with respect to these operations under the parity operator which involves special reflection angular momentum vectors are unchanged nuclear force is attractive force nuclear force is strongly spin dependent uh, however the angular momentum is not a true or polar vector it is a pseudo or axial vector that does not invert when r to minus r this follows directly from the definition of r cos p the terms spin terms s1 square s2 square or s1 dot s2 are invariant with respect to time reversal and are therefore allowed the total spin is the sum of the individual spins s equal to s1 plus s2 s square we can write as s dot s then s1 plus s2 dot s1 plus s2 then we can write s1 square plus s2 square plus 2 s1 dot s2 thus s1 dot s2 is equal to 1 by 2 s square minus s1 square minus s2 square we must remember that in quantum mechanics all squared angular momenta evaluate as s square equal to h cross square into s into s plus 1 നമ്മൾ ഇത് ക്വാണ്ടം മെക്കാനിക്സിൽ പഠിച്ചിട്ടുണ്ട് j സ്ക്വയർ ഈക്വൽ ടു j ഇൻ j പ്ലസ് h ക്ലോസ് സ്ക്വയർ ഇൻ ടു j ഇൻ j പ്ലസ് 1 therefore we could also write the potential including vc and vs as v of r equal to minus s1 dot s2 by h ക്ലോസ് സ്ക്വയർ minus 1 by 4 into v1 of r plus s1 dot s2 by h cross square plus o plus 3 by 4 into v3 of r here v1 of r and v3 of r potential that separately give the proper singlet and triplet behavior then another property is the internuclear potential includes a non central term known as tensor potential evidence for the tensor force comes from comes primarily from the observed quadrupole moment of the ground state of the neutron and a state 
and s state l equal for l equal to zero wave function is spherically symmetric the electric quadrupole moment vanishes wave functions with mixed l states must result from non-central potential another property is the nucleo nucleon force is charge symmetric okay this means that proton proton interaction is identical to the neutron neutron interaction here charge refers to the character of the nucleon proton or neutron and not to the electric charge when this is done the resulting singlet pp parameters are a equal to Cross section a equal to minus 17.1 plus or minus 0.2 femtometer r0 equal to 2.84 plus or minus 0.03 from these are very good agreement with the measured neutron neutron parameters for neutron neutron we have got a equal to minus 16.6 .6 plus or minus 0.5 femtometer r0 equal to 2.66 plus or minus 0.15 femtometer which is strongly supports the notion of charge symmetry other property is that the nucleon nucleon force is nearly charge independent this means that the three nuclear force neutron neutron proton proton and proton neutron are identical again corresponding for the proton proton coulomb force The another important property is that the nucleon nucleon interaction becomes repulsive at short distance. They are attractive, but they are the first property was that the nuclear force is attractive. You can say that the force is attractive, but they are repulsive at short distance. This conclusion follows from qualitative consideration of the nuclear density. As we add more nucleons, the nucleus grows in such a way that its central density remains roughly constant. And thus, something is keeping the nucleons from crowding too closely together. At about 300 MeV, the S wave phase shift becomes negative, corresponding to a change from an attractive to repulsive force. Other properties that the nucleon nucleon interaction may also depend on the relative velocity or momentum of the nucleons. Okay, thank you.